Today is Ash Wednesday, and for all of you Christians who celebrate it, what are you giving up for Lent if you do that? We are um, giving up a lot and doing a lot. I'm going to ask the kids everything that they're giving up. Maddie came up with a really good one for herself. I was kind of impressed. For me, I'm giving up all junk food, and this is a way to kickstart. Like, I actually look forward to Lent every year because it's a way to recharge, reinvest, um, refocus, and um, put things into a different perspective. So, all junk food, and I'm adding running to my daily schedule of things to do. And I ran today, and Dan is my trainer. Holy cow, he's kind of tough. He ran me down. I don't know how far we ran. We didn't run very long, but I'm so totally out of shape. Maybe for 20 minutes, maybe a half an hour, I don't know. But um, I'm still coughing from it. And he ran me down a hill, a really big hill. I mean, we're in Tennessee, we're in the mountains. And um, you know, I just got over a cough cold and I'm hacking like I've got asthma now. I had to run back up that hill. Down the hill was easy, running back up was hard. There's Kobe. It's too loud in the RV, it's a rainy, yucky day. Kids were out puddle jumping, running around, playing, and now they're all soaking wet and cold. So, um, pretty much it's a day of learning. We're going to do school all day. We're going to talk about, you know, what Lent means and all that kind of stuff. And uh, I have a friend of mine who came up with something pretty interesting. She said this Lent might sound really bad, but this Lent is all about her. Getting her life back on track. Getting the things she needs to do accomplished and whatnot. And I was thinking, I was like, that's pretty good. Because I think as moms, you tend to often put yourself like not even last I mean like you're beyond last and um he, he likes that do you like that he uh, loves to be outside no matter what the weather uh, uh. yeah you gotta talk to the camera go talk to the camera whoops you need to see the camera you go talk say something say something so much to say. Kenny, what are you giving up for Lent? Um, or doing for Lent? Ellie, what are you up candy? Uh, candy? Kindle. Kindle. You're giving up Kindle? Dally, what you doing? He's hiding from me. <laughs> what are you giving up for Lent or doing? Kindle and PSG. Cardi, what you doing? What? What are you doing for Lent? I'm giving up junk food. I'm not giving up junk food. Junk food will be hard because I have candy. Yeah, junk food will be hard. What are you giving up? <laughs> Emmy. And giving my brothers and giving everybody else the best. What else are you doing? I'm, I'm giving up fighting and hitting and staying. Good. Hey, Katie, what are you doing for Lent? I am saying a rosary every day for somebody. Cool. Craig's working on a video. Alabama freestyle kayaking video. Grady, what are you doing for Lent? Uh, Kindle. Oh yeah, you're giving up Kindle. He's doing Kindle. Ellie, what are you doing for Lent? <laughs> oh yeah? Mommy, look! <laughs> shake your body! Shake your, <laughs> shake your body! Shake your shake, shake, shake your body! Be gentle. Shake, 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 shake. Good. Bye -bye. shake your body! Shake, shake. Go, Kobe! Go, Kobe, go! Go, go, be, go, go, be, go! What you doing for Lent, Grip Brody? Giving up Kindles, PSPs, PlayStation, and computers. Huh. Mommy, look a broken down tree. Like our fire? A broken down tree! Yes, I love your fire. Like our warm. I'm always going to find out it's not warm enough. It's, we've just been, it's so cold today. Hi. To the party. Ah! Hi. Don't go near the edge. It's like their second home up there or something, you know? Funny. So I talked to somebody from the UK today, and uh, they're doing this show where this guy pretty much goes from country to country. And He's asking like the big questions in life about marriage and parenting and death and life and birth and um, that kind of stuff. Just the questions that, you know, he said he's turning 40 this year and he wants to, this 
he has all these questions still and he's starting to think about settling down at 40. He's starting to think about settling down. Um, uh, so they wanted to know if we would be interested in sitting down with him and discussing, you know, I guess on camera probably, spending the day with him or whatever, discussing our philosophies on parenting. And uh, she said she'd read my book, or she was starting, well, she didn't say she was reading my book. She said that she had bought my book and that she is going to read it soon. But that uh, there was one comment on there that it was, you know, what, did, what was the comment? Um, it was called Attachment Parenting with an Attitude. And she said that made her buy it. So whoever gave me the three stars for Attachment Parenting with an Attitude, thank you. Because it made this girl buy my book and now she wants me on her show. Huh, thank you for the three stars. Hey, I'm gonna cut these logs and just lay them down. And he like moved them. And uh, it's super cute and funny. Look at him just laying in them. Very cold. He is cold. That's why he's by the fire. Look, he even has that one there. Let's take his kennel. Hey, Eddie. Hi. <laughs> like, what are you guys doing? Come on, get warm. Get out right there. Oh, yeah. Come on. Okay. Look at that fire. Nice and hot. Look how red that is in there. Let's see if the camera can be hot. Look at that. It's so hot. Yeah. Now look at him. He's on the chair. <coughs> Right by the fire. <coughs> Brody got angry with his log. <sighs> what? How much hits did that take? Too many. Like back in freezing. there, freezing. those are like super hot coal. Have a so, that. we are mar mm. roasting marshmallows mm. <laughs> without he chocolate and or graham crackers. Right down there that I've ever seen. Why Cardi have to go inside? Because he gave it up. He gave up junk food. These are the hottest hot coals I've ever seen. It's right coming out here. Katie! Go to fire! Oh, Maddie, oh. blow it out! Blow it out! Look, let go really quick. I'm going to pass the other to Brody. Maddie, you don't want to put your... Your marshmallow right next to the hot coal. Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Blow it out! Blow it out! Blow it out! Okay, it went out. You look smashed, Allie. Wow, that's a perfect marshmallow. Brody. Guys, you can't put that ah. in there. What's for dinner? He wants. He wants to see how gun cooks. I, put, I dropped my marshmallow. Why? Dying. Guys, look, I'm moving this around. No, Dally. Oh, you just hit the camera. Burn. Brody's letting his burn. Dad, I can blow out the fire. So you guys can blow Cook ones. You're gonna blow out the fire if we don't go in. Blow it out. Good luck with that. Try Andy. blowing it. It might be a little bit too hot. Try blowing it. Emmy, oh guys, and Brody, you should give Emmy that Do marshmallow. It. We should have it. That would be a funny video. Emmy, like, I think you're just trying to kill that marshmallow, Daddy. Brody. Brody. Oh, they they <laughs> just caught on that. Emmy, what are we having? Then I Emmy, you're such a pretty princess. Let's oh, no. Can you stop moving my the two booty yours and X at the bottom? Yeah, I know it's Brody, you gotta help me. Mine's the one that's bent, Dally. 